I woke up this morning in the mood for vlogging, so I figured I would vlog. Sorry, this is kind of up close and personal for somebody who just woke up, but I'm gonna take you through today. This is a vlog of a day in the life, last week of class edition. Um, today's my second to last day of class, so I figured I'd show you what today looks like for me and just take you for the ride. Um, I start my day, wake up, wake up at seven, go to the bathroom and just like, you know, clear my eyes, use the bathroom, etc. brush my teeth, and then spend some time do reading my devotional as per usual. Um, this, along with my Bible, and this is currently what I'm using. Um, I don't check my phone, which has been so freeing. Like I like to do I like to, you know, not check my phone before I read my devotional and before I get ready for the next thing, which is working out. Um, I typically like to start my workouts by 7.45, um, and I think I'm on track to, to, to start that um, because it's like around 7.30 right now. So I'll make my bed, um, change, do all that stuff. My skin is looking kind of struggle bussy right now, and that's just because it's finals. And that's just like the reaction that my body has. So um, catch me in the summer looking fleeky, but for now I'm gonna be on that acne struggle bus. <laughs> um, so yeah, let's get let's get ready to start the day. out of the shower it's like about 15 quarter quarter to nine um <laughs> and it is time for skincare i cleansed with my tula cleanser before i even got in the shower um polish choice topicals this is in hyperpigmentation cream serum cream um indy lee eye serum my all-time favorite moisturizer from belief and for SPF, this Tula Protecting Glow. So that's all we're gonna be doing for today. So basically, all I've been doing is outlining. <laughs> um, this is probably gonna be a really boring day to vlog, um, but I've been doing that since about 9.15, it's now 10.20. Um, and what that looks like for me is looking at an old outline um, that provides pretty much an overview of the course. So the, the course I'm outlining for is corporations right now, right? Um, and the weird thing about this is that normally like when you outline you'll like use the syllabus as a guide for like you know the topics that you covered in the course etc but this syllabus doesn't have that all it has is just a list of the cases there's no like breaking it down by topic or subject area or anything like that like the syllabus only has the cases that we read um, so in this circumstance, I really needed to use someone else's outline to kind of map out the, the concepts that we discussed. So I'm using that to guide me. Also going to be using the case book just to like make sure that the topics kind of align or just to use that as a reference for the topics that we, we've covered. Um, but I'll show you actually really quickly what the other person's outline looks like. Um, so this person was very detailed and thorough, which I appreciate color coded and everything. And so I go through and I read it and then I just, sorry for the sirens, I just compare that to what I understand, see if there were any differences. I might have to cross reference with portions of a lecture, for example. Um, but this is a very helpful guide for just like what we talked about in the course. So. That's the vibe for this morning. In about 30 minutes, I have a phone call um, and then I'm just gonna be working probably until lunch.
it's one o'clock and I am taking a quick midday break to work on a little bit of influencer stuff like sending emails and signing a contract that actually has to get signed by today. So I, this is like a contract that I've looked at and like negotiated a little in terms of the rate and just some of the terms. So I think it's going to be good to go, but I do just wanna take one final look at it. So that's just gonna take me probably the next 20 minutes before I dive back into some work. It's a little after three and I have a class at 3.15. Around two o'clock, I got incredibly sleepy and tired, like unbelievably so. So I had to get coffee. Normally I get a latte, but I told myself that I need to stop. <laughs> um, even though it was a nice treat, I literally have coffee at home um, and I just bought almond milk and it needs to get used because I need to use the stuff that I buy for myself at home. So made myself a little cup of coffee. I also don't know why, but every single day, Columbia sends us like, oh, take 10 with me, like a guided meditation type thing. And I've never ever done it before, but for some reason today, like I just felt like, oh, I'm in the mood to do this. So I think I'm about to do it right now before class starts. Oh, they said go away from your desk. The banker that his brother was using the information from the discussions to trade. And at first he didn't know, but then when he found out, he continued to help him and give him more information. And then eventually the um, investment banker began courting interest and his brother ended up connecting with that love interest brother and giving him inside information as well as well it is almost five o'clock class just ended um and this is typically the time that i if the weather permits like to just go on a walk um to move my legs to get fresh air etc um and just like reflect and meditate i'm really all about the chill vibes because i can't stress myself out um so it's perfect timing because when i feel myself feeling like tired um it's a good like break in the day i'll go for a walk come back probably eat dinner and then start my evening of continued outlining and yeah so come with me for my walk today Greetings. Um, it is almost one in the morning. It's currently quarter to one. Um, I spent the rest of the night working. <laughs> um, I obviously, you know, taking your Instagram breaks and your TikTok breaks or whatever. But I thought I was gonna stop in time to like, you know, wind down my wind down and be done working by like 11:30 so that I could like shower, be in bed. 12, 12, 15, but I ended up doing research or like getting inspired to do research for um, my seminar final paper. So I did that for like an extra hour and then I shower as I shower every night just to, you know, give myself some me time and I'm getting ready for bed. 
So I think it makes sense to wrap the video here so I can do the rest of my skincare routine and wind down for the night. Um, but yeah, this was my second to last day of classes. Super excited to be done, hopefully, with Zoom school, period. Hopefully. Hopefully my last day of class is my last day of Zoom class for a while. Um, fingers crossed, wear your mask, get vaccinated, please. Um, <laughs> and yeah, so I'm gonna end the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like what you saw, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, all of that fun stuff. Um, I'd be happy to do more of this when I'm, you know, feeling it, if that's what you wanna see. Um, but yeah, have a great night. If you are watching this in the evening, <laughs> I'm in nighttime mode. Um, and yeah, see you next time. Bye guys.